Hey guys, Martin here from Tactical Sports and the Weekend Warrior Australia. <sighs> Me, owning a business, running a business with, with Iggy, selling tactical gear is a bit of a problem because over here is all of our stock. And the problem with it being here at my house is I play with it, as in I fiddle with it, I learn it, I tinker with it, and then I end up buying it. So in one of the videos we did last week, I was talking about the, the, this pack from Viper. Now this is the VX Buckle Up Charger Pack. It starts out as a very slim pack and is expandable. Now, the reason why it's a bit of a problem for me being around this kind of stuff is I like to learn how everything works and I fit it up to my own gear and then it stays there, which means I buy it with money I don't have. Just like this one. So this charger pack is now attached to my VX Buckle Up utility rig that we spoke about in the video. It's a utility rig with a scrote pouch. It's obviously... A harness style chest rig and now on the back is the charger pack the only real reason for this video is not to gloat that I bought one for myself because I should probably be selling it to you guys but the fact that how easy it was to attach it to the chest rig um, then if you remember this the rear of this bag is full molly so the vertical molly strips here and here, and then obviously the horizontal ones there. Now, the two molly straps literally just loop straight over the, the H harness on the back of the rig here. And it's tethered at the top. Done. So as you can see here, the molly goes straight over the top of the H. Just mollied all the way down as normal. I'm not going to use molly on... The, a plate carrier with this pack because it's going on this chest rig which is open on the back the waist strap that is part of the obviously part of the utility rig I've just run straight through the bottom of the molly so it's tethered at the bottom by the waist strap and at the top by the H harness which means there are, obviously there's no extra straps required for the charger pack because it just purely integrates with the back of the utility rig now, i got to say, I was anticipating sitting down for half an hour to work out how to get it to, to, to go together. Obviously, I started out by taking off the, the shoulder straps that come with a charger pack. I took off the extra straps because it comes with a couple of other ways of tethering it. Um, initially, I tethered it on using um, these side loops here. Didn't need to. It actually made it sit a little bit too high under my armpits and I just uh, changed it so it went over the back at the top of the H harness there and perfect absolutely spot on it sits in the small of my back you know right smack bang in the middle of my back which is the perfect height if I want to run a camelback and of course the charge utility rig has got molly on the shoulders so I can run the camelback loops through there um, brilliant super super happy not that it was designed for it, but my plat attack chest rig, which is the where is it? The Mark V Peacekeeper. Uh, similar kind of H harness setup, and this one is um, one of Iggy's utility packs that he sorry hydration packs that he gave me. This one's issued for his time in Afghanistan, I believe. Um, to get this one onto my H harness, I've had to use, as you can see here, a whole heap of Velcro webbing to strap it because there was no easy means, I guess, of getting it to attach. I could have used the shoulder straps as well, but they were too wide and it was a bit too funky. So this was a three or four attempt to make it suit because it wasn't an A to specifically design to work with the B, whereas this here from Viper, the VX Buckle Up Charger Pack is designed to go with the VX Utility Chest Rig. Perfect. Match made in heaven. Um, I've still got the mags in the front here from the G36. There's four, there's two external, there's two on the internal. 
this great pouch hanging, hang, hanging underneath, there's nothing in it right now. And then in the stuffer pack on the side here, I have my ghillie suit that I've set up. Not used it yet, but I've set it up. So to put the chest rig on, I just undo the side straps, shove it on, find my side straps, and do it all back up. You're not really going to be able to see, but absolutely spot on works brilliantly the stuffer pack is a pretty big cumbersome thing where it's when it's full of the ghillie suit obviously i wouldn't be carrying it necessarily in a game i'll be either wearing it or just removing the the suit from the pack there but super happy with the charger pack it's small it's light it can be utilized purely just as a small backpack. It can be utilized for a three liter camelback. Or of course it can be, not that, part, not that one. It can be all unzipped. Where's the main zip? You're hiding further around the back. I can unzip the main expansion all the way around. And then quite easily I can put in a rain jacket or I can put in I could get a sleeping bag in there great really 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 good it goes from being a very small just pack utility pack for a short spell or it is big enough for a 24 hour on your foot food all your essentials spare bits and pieces probably not big enough for enough water for 24 hours I can get my three liter in there I would probably need to carry some more extra water, but absolutely nailed it. Good job, Viper, and thank you for selling yourself to me and attaching yourself to my utility rig. Thanks, guys. Laters.